so your support duty starts with mm-hmm. helping me fix the cage. Send it, bro. Yeah, What's the scene, bro? Started. Oh, nothing much, man. Is Good breakfast morning. on? I have no clue. We'll find out. Yeah, I'm fucking no starving. No blood for breakfast. Damn. <laughs> I spot a fixie. That's a nervous heart rate. Good morning, TFN. Good morning. Are you guys ready? Yeah. It's gonna be comfortable here. Yeah. Dude, that is not cool at all, Macha. Very bad. So, Steph, what do you want? Like, this should be. Yeah, it should be like this. Like, like, like this. I'm straight away coming riding out. <laughs> Dude, you're, you're, you're the borderline man. Actually, what is, yeah. What is that thing Th- there? That game's talk, Macha. You have to take like A4 paper and cut it and put that. Have you painted this all and customized it? No, no, no. This is actually, this is the nicest colorway of all the Tarmac SN6s. <laughs> Ranking begins. Calm, karo, calm, karo. Calm, karo. Stuck in traffic. So we had a pretty gnarly start meandering through Bangalore's traffic. But now we're heading nice road. It's actually a nice road. We've got to wait for clearance. Once that's done, it's going to be smooth sailing. And when we are getting into the nice road, okay, don't take the regular lanes. Just right on the shoulder, on the left. Okay. So it looks like we're doing a bit of a TTT over here. Four of us. It's fun. Almost nearing the first checkpoint. SS1. Sounds scary, I know, but it's, it's the post station one. 56 kilometers in. Nice hard ride. Didn't expect it to be this hard. But it's good. It's a good opener. I'm in the second group with Naveen and a couple of other riders. Gonna tank up some water. Little climb over here. There's a competitive segment after that. Three kilometers after the first post station. Should be fun. I'm really liking this. The bike's good. The weather's good. People good. Traffic. It's so this is what a support station looks like. So you all guys smashed it. You're planning on smashing it again? We were we were riding like uh, zone one. Oh yeah, the zone, zone one. Zone easy, you know, easy peasy. Like we, we make thought it was CS. Yeah, I was like, uh, it must have started already. <laughs> yeah. Drafting, but nobody's watching. Yeah, I was I'm wondering, wondering, is there like this unscheduled TTT happening or? Just practice for the TTT. Yeah, so I know the team. The teams are forming up now. Yeah, you can see that. So you're the TTT specialist. Yeah. I mean, I think you want it. Doesn't fit for us, noobs. Sweet ass. Oh, what the hell? No, it was there, but good. when you finished, it was all worn out. It was Who makes this? There's a guy, a biomechanical, biomechanical uh, guy uh, in San Francisco. It seems it's super flexy. Yeah, it's kind of You used to take okay. a, yeah. You used to take about 20 yeah. Good for minutes. Yeah, you can't talk about perennial pressure. Huh? No. Is this what you use for the RAM? Yeah, this is what you use. Yeah. Wow. What's it called? Infinity. Infinity L2. Okay. Yeah, with the normal saddle, you need to raise your... So are these like custom made yeah. or...? So it's custom made? No. Okay. Okay, it's a... It's a so they check general. your sit bone width. But this is... No, 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 no. no, no. It's the opposite of a... Yeah. It's the opposite. Yeah. The, your sit bones are here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh, interesting. It's yeah. like a... So the saddle position and the saddle height. Yeah. Uh, it's time to raise yeah, yeah, yeah. it high. And what's the base of the saddle made of? Is it carbon or? It's not carbon. No, no, no. It's like a plastic. Oh, it's made in California. It's got yeah. a label underneath. Yeah. <laughs> this is a completely vegan chair. No shit. So if you're plant based, this is for you. You gotta hammer it. Not plant based. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Here's the second uh, 
fourth station. I think we're about 70 odd kilometers from Bangladesh and about 16 kilometers from the competitor segment, which is the 10 kilometer time trial. There's also lunch before that, but I think some of us, including Naveen, uh, we decided we can do lunch probably in Mysore. Yeah, you can't do a TT on a full stomach, can you? But the ride's been incredible. A lot of traffic, which makes it a bit sketchy. But overall, it's good fun. I mean, I'm really enjoying the bike, the ride so far. What do you think about the, the awesome traffic? People forgot it on a Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> the guys from Dubai. <laughs> so how's the ride been so far? Oh, it's been awesome. Yeah, awesome. yeah. It's really nice. Just the beginning, the traffic in the yeah, town was a little uh, dicey, but otherwise. What about the been. traffic out here? Did you did you experience something like? Yeah. No, we I were doing about 44. Yeah. yeah. I can say like Dubai, we've been spoiled. <laughs> I think I think actual road biking yeah. happened today. Actual road we experienced today. Nice. Because over there everything is just laid out with well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flat. <laughs> yeah, you have to yeah, watch out for the bumps and the walls yeah. and stuff like that. So yeah. and suddenly some <laughs> truck will pass you and you know <laughs> so to the side and okay, watch out guys. So it's good good adrenaline I suppose. No, right? Seriously, yeah. the first time I got a bell on my bike. Like, Oh, dude, that's wicked, man! <laughs> what bell is that? Where can you get this? Spur cycle. Ooh, fancy. Fancy, but it looks fancy. Oh, this way? Yeah. Hey, that is so wicked, dude. So nice. That is so. That is that is hipster. Very old bicycle. Very old. Yeah, yeah. That is hipster as fuck. <laughs> Very cool. So I'm cycling with Vivek Bateja and Shiva and Shiva ironically has a road named after him. I mean how cool is that? Shiva's road right? I mean they had an inauguration ceremony for that and they said Shiva's road <laughs> inauguration the ones where MLA is coming. I was like okay that, that makes it all legit. Riding with the legend. I can have that. Maybe not that. That and that. What's this? I can't have this. This, this, that. So what do you think about this TFN business, bro? Yeah? Yeah. It's fucking awesome, right? Yeah. Yeah. Road markings. I mean, to do it over here? Yeah. At this scale, bro. At this scale, yeah. I can imagine, dude. Huh. Oh, crazy. Yeah, that would be a trip, dude. <laughs> you mistook an auto guy for a cyclist. Yeah, what? Like that, right? <laughs> How to go, Wanky? <laughs> it's bad. It's bad, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, if you guys say it suffered, you all suffered. Yeah, it's the same thing for everyone, right? Yeah. No, I'm glad I that I suffered also then. Different levels. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. The, the most you, the more you suffer, the better the, the result. better the result. Yeah, that's true. But uh, I, I kind of lost steam in between. Oh uh, shucks. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah, but it's, it's it's just one day done. You got yeah. you got seven more to yeah. kick some ass. <laughs> kind of sets the stone. Okay. Yeah. But let's see. It's yeah. it's only gonna get worse, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So what is it like doing the ram and being the first Indian to successfully finish it solo? Ram is a uh, way of life for me. Man. Really? Yeah. It's much more beyond those things. Uh, Ram is very intense for me. So Not only for me, for my family, for, your... for my wife, for my kid. So, and you, I'm sure you had a very tight crew as well that was a part of the whole thing. Yeah, true. It's all teamwork. Yeah. So there's so much of transformation. That it's happens. For me, is a transformation. Sweet. Yeah. Uh, for the good. And you're a soldier in the Indian Army. Yeah. How do you manage putting in time for this while 
That's because of the strong desire that I have. Right. To be at the finish line of RAM. So, added to that, you know, I'm, I'm grateful to my organization, even though I'm a self-funded athlete. Right. And Army was not keen on sponsoring and all that. Was it? Yeah. But the qualities which my organization has imbibed. Right. Yeah. So, so I think you... What, that is what made me or gave me the ability to dream about RAM, take the risk. Wow. I put everything on the line. <laughs> really? Family, job. I put everything on the line. Wow. So and wow. how many years in the making was this? Eight years. Wow. Yeah. Wow, man. <laughs> okay, I did not know that. <laughs> this is the inside scoop. <laughs> wow. I mean, that's that's phenomenal. It is, man. It, is, it is intense for me. I can't. There's not even a single day which has gone without thinking about RAM. Wow. The past three years, I did RAM in 2016. Right. Where I did not finish. Yeah. Short of 450 miles. Short of 450 miles. Yeah. That's probably just about a day a day away. Yeah, yeah. The uh, relentless involvement that was involved. Right. Uh, in RAM, for RAM, has so much of impact that not even a single day, even till day. Right. Goes without thinking about RAM or talking about RAM. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure it's now it's a part of your because, uh, process. Is, yeah. Right. What it does is. The way it does to me is it digs much deeper into my mind. Got it. You know? Like a borewell into my mind. Wow. Drilling. Wow. Know? And there's so much of me in that. <laughs> that you're still probably driven out. <laughs> <laughs> wow, man. So that, is, uh, that is what. That is why RAM is special for me. And uh, do you plan to do it again or is this like a thing or is this like a one time? No, 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 Ben. Can you tell me? I want to do it every year, man. But practicality. True. Being a self-funded athlete. True. This time when I did RAM, I had to take loans. Right. And all that. So to, to recover from that, it almost takes three years, man. Shit. Because even though it was a shoestring budget, right. But it's it's very difficult. The because the financial expenditure is monumental. So I need to find a sustainable support. Right. So if I do that, I want to do it every year, man. Definitely. <laughs> now that's but that's that's CC. And I want to grow in this sport. But yeah, but that's phenomenal, man. Like, hats off to you. When I first heard about you completing the RAM, I was like, we're not so bad after all. <laughs> you know? We can do it. And yeah, that's a big motivation, man. Like, so, you inspire. That's awesome. Yep. I'm pretty sure because uh, we are heading into Mysore now, so Kaveri goes into Mysore. That's where the uh, dam is, no? KRS, Krishna Raja Sagar. This wasn't an easy ride, definitely a, a hardish ride, more like a training ride for me. I like it, it's not bad. The competitive segment was pretty brutal. Yeah, everybody found it brutal, so I'm happy that I wasn't the only guy who found it brutal. Finished it in about uh, 19 minutes, I think it was uh, 11 kilometer segment. Day one is the end. 